Hey everybody, it's Edder, Edder Silva, or for those who may know me as Simple Silva, or or Silva, or for my older students that I've taught before, old man, even though I'm just turned 30. Um, hi. Um, I know what you're wondering. Well, what do you, what's the video for? Um, well, honestly, if I'm going to cut straight to it, I'm looking for your help. I... I finally come a point in my life where I feel like I want to call something my own and create something that not only you can enjoy, but I can enjoy doing it for you guys. Um, you know, whether it's a digital or physical, I'm looking to create something. Ever since I was a little kid, I've always loved um, drawing, drawings being some, one of the biggest impacts of my life. If you look at my bookshelf, either half of it is comic books but the other half is just drawing books, how to draw this, how to draw that, art books. I've always been fascinated by drawing and and just, you know, creating my own thing. Over the years, I've created my own style. Um, and I'm still learning, you know, I'm still developing my own style, continuing to grow. But I feel I officially like I've come to a point in my life where I say, this is the time. This is my time. And I looking for your help to try and get a iPad Pro in order to make these dreams come true. Now, um, the money I'm looking to raise is $1,700. I'm thinking, you know, I, I know you're thinking, it's like, ah, why so much money? Um, the reason why is just um, currently, the iPad that I have is great. Don't get me wrong. I love it. I've been able to do so much with what I have, and it's great. Um, what is unfortunate is I'm limited by the specifications that my iPad has, whether it's the storage or the, um, the components inside of it that limit me on either layers, resolution, or, like I said, storage. Um, I... Uh, I wish to have a device that where those limitations don't exist or there are very little of them. So I'm looking to not only acquire an iPad Pro, specifically the, not the big iPad, like the Pro, the, the average size, you know, the one that's about the same size as a regular iPad, um, but the 500 gig version of it, the 512 to be specific, um, where the, the, that's where my storage problems would probably cease to exist. I know probably, I probably fill that up quickly, especially what I want with what, with what I want to do with it. I don't, I don't even know if that made sense, but, um, but it's enough storage to get me started and without having to worry that I have to delete stuff in order to fit other stuff, you know? Um, I'm also looking to acquire a new Apple Pencil to go along with it. And also the big part is to get Apple care to at least two years of it. Um, just because I don't want to, you know, raise all this money, it's, you know, God forbid something happens to the device and then I can't get it fixed and that's it. No, I want to make sure that this is insured so that when, you know, you know, don't want it to happen, but if let's say something happened, I'm insured I can get it fixed or get it replaced. And I feel like that's important. And then, of course, a screen protector in the case, but I, you know, those, I don't spend $50, $60 on a case. I spend, uh, of course, I spend it on a good case, but I don't, I'm not going to go overboard. Or I'm going to get this big bulky thing. Uh, and then, of course, a screen protector because that's always important. Um, but that's why I'm looking to get the 1700 for for the iPad, the Apple Pencil, the two years of Apple Care, and then, of course, a screen protector in a case for it. Um, overall, I feel like with this, I can actually get these ideas out and actually get the, uh, I guess you could say, get the ball rolling or, or get this, this fire that I have in me, if you want to call it that, to keep burning and that to actually physically show you what I have, the ideas, the stories that have been really building up inside me that I want to share with you guys. So, um, if at all possible, 
if you can help me with this, I would really greatly appreciate it. Um, and, and this is the first time I'm doing something like this. If if you don't want to help, if you feel like it's, you know, you can't, and, and that's okay. Don't feel bad. That's fine. This is just me trying to acquire something, but with your help, you know, it's not just me. It's, you, you know, I'm, I'm looking to kind of say like, hey, help me and it won't go in vain. Like you won't, you won't uh, regret it, you know, because I'll show you that I will use the money that you gave me for something amazing. And then you'll be like, money well spent. And of course, I'm not just going to, you know, make you pay for things I create. I will be releasing things for free. Uh, some things that, you know, not big things. Like I have some big projects. Don't get me wrong. Even some things I'm considering for like a Kickstarter or something. But of course, I do plan on releasing things out there that you can enjoy that you can say, well, those that one dollar or two dollars I spent were well worth it. Um, but if at all, if you feel it in your heart to help me, I would greatly appreciate it. If not, that's OK. All I can say is if you could share this with someone else, I would greatly appreciate it. You know, if you know me, I would appreciate the help. If not. It's okay, you know. Um, I just all I can say is, you know, uh, if you can't help me, help the next person, you know. And um, thank you for listening. If you've come to this point, and you're still listening to my, you know, my craziness with you know the movies and stuff in the back. And you're like, oh my gosh, I do greatly appreciate it. Um, I just hope you take the time to really consider it. And if you do. Thank you so much. And you, I guess, like I said before, you won't regret it. I do um, thank you for your time. And um, I hope you have a great day. If you want to follow some of the stuff that I'm making right now, currently, uh, you can follow me on Instagram. Uh, follow, uh, look for uh, Mortal Illustrations, M, Mortal Illustrations. And you'll probably find me. It literally, the little logo says Mortal with a white background. And that's who I am, you know, for my art stuff. Um, if you want to follow me and, um, you can kind of keep, you know, updates on what's going on with my stuff. I'll definitely be posting a lot more now and stuff that I've been making. So, um, again, thank you for your time. I hope you have a great day. And if you do happen to help me out, trust me, I will prove to you that your donation was well worth it. Thank you.